Hi, uh, welcome again to Fuckle. This week we'll be reviewing a movie it should, really shouldn't have escaped your attention. It's called Jurassic World. This is the fourth installment of the Jurassic series. Mm -hmm. It stars Chris Pratt, Bryce Dallas Howard, uh, we have got uh, Irfan Khan, and Jurassic World takes, takes place something like 20 years. Yep. after Jurassic Park, where the park has actually been open yes. for about 10 years, if I'm not and wrong. And takes about 20,000 visitors a day. Yeah, so Chris Pratt uh, is somewhat of a dino whisperer. Yes, yes, yes right. he's a dino whisperer. So he can, he, can, he can communicate with the raptors. Yes. Yeah. So what, what they have done now is that because the, the, the park has gone a bit sort of stale, uh, so instead of just reviving the normal dinosaur, they decided to create one which is meaner, faster, bigger and whatever else. So lo and behold, the dinosaur escapes. So the whole movie ensues. I quite liked it actually. There's nothing to shout about the movie. It's things that we have seen before. Special effects were good. But as far as special effects, special effects is dinosaurs running around. Yep. There were some scary bits. But one thing I, I noticed, just looking at my kids watching it, they seem to have that experience when we watch Jurassic Park. It, oh, it, right, it right. So, so reboot it for them right. to watch big dinosaurs running around, being scared. So if the, the aim was to get new uh, converts into the Jurassic mm, uh, franchise, franchise I think they succeeded with the kids. Well, it's already broken balls of his records anyway, yeah. anyway right? And the, what's, what's the not to like, I suppose? Uh, yeah, the not towards uh, Jurassic Park include actually going to the original Jurassic Park yep. as well. Yeah. And they use the old cars as yeah. well, the old Ford Explorers. Yep. So yeah, so it's, it's actually, I guess, maybe what they're trying to do is, is a bit of a, a nostalgia type thing yep. for, for the rest of us. For the rest of us that grew up with New York. I watched it when we were, you know, well, we were in the 20s at the time. <laughs> when we were kids. Yeah, so when we were not really kids, but you know, quite young. What is your take on the high heels kerfuffle? Well, oh yeah, but Bryce Dallas, how mm. running around yeah. in high heels, you know. Yep. I she can run around me any day, heels or otherwise. You know, yeah. It doesn't really bother me. You know, just like, knock yourself out. Yeah. See, if or she knock can, me out. Yeah. <laughs> if she can run in heels, good on her. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, I don't think there's anything to be read into that. Yeah, and then was, I think, oh yeah, there was also this bit about, yeah, it's not being feminist or, or it's like, yeah. you know, misogynist. So yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's a movie about dinosaurs. Yeah, it's a movie about dinosaurs, big animals, you know. Yeah. I mean, Stop reading yeah. more into it. They, it, it's opened enough doors to, to number two and number three now. Yeah, and the movie sort of hooks everything well. Mm -hmm. um, there's no real deep inspection into the backstory of the characters. Who yeah. cares? Who cares? You and know. so it's a Spielberg enjoyable family yeah. fair, and Chris Pratt rides a bike. Yes, it's quite a nice bike. A Time Scrambler. Yeah. So uh, that's product placement right there. Yeah, and the Samsung Hall and the, yeah, the Samsung Vri Hall. Verizon and everything else. Yes. So how many stars would you give it? I'd give it um, four stars. Um, I'm not sure whether it's the best movie we've seen this year. What, 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 what was the best we've seen this year so far? Well, of all the blockbusters for summer... Mad Max! Oh yes, okay. I so think Mad it's Mad not Max. better than Mad Max, definitely. Yes, but only because we couldn't understand Mad Max. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah. And, and Mad Max had the guitar guy. Yeah, yeah, and you know, the guitar, flamethrower guitar. You know, that you gives can't it one that. and a half stars already just <laughs> for that guy. Yeah. I would give it four stars as well. I think good family entertainment, uh, quite decent. So, uh, so again, happy Bopo Hey, what's next, huh?